Hey guys, um, Terry Claus here. I was just going to the mall because I had a free um, coupon and I wasn't going to look at any of the machines because I hate the machines in our mall. They're so weak. I was walking by and this is toy chest one and you guys, you guys know how much I like Hello Kitty. I walked by and I found my kryptonite. What the freak is that? I can't even zoom in. There is an actual licensed Hello Kitty watch in here. What the heck? What is that about? You know, I hate this machine because it's so weak, but I've never seen that one before. I doubt it's licensed. I bet that's a, I bet it's Hello Kitty knockoff. I don't see anywhere that it says Sanrio. It doesn't say Sanrio. It says Kitty. So that's definitely a knockoff Hello Kitty watch. That kind of makes it like a little bit cooler. Oh my word, that's not going to pick it up at all. You know what? I was going to save my money for groceries, but you know that I'm totally going to play this now. Well, not right now because I don't have change. I only have 20s. And... <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to I guess I'm gonna have to get something to eat um we have like a new pizza place there so I'm probably gonna get some change and then you guys know that I'm gonna try for that and you guys know that I'm gonna fail but I just wanted to show you that it's a it's a knockoff Hello Kitty watch and I know that it's a knockoff and it's probably made in like Hong Kong because I bought like some knockoff Hello Kitty um tank tops that said Hello Kitty and it was spelled wrong it was spelled like H-E-L-L-O-W like hell low aha uh -huh. The Chinese are so funny. And it was, and Kitty was spelled like K-I-T-T-I-E. So it was like H-E-L-L-O-W-K-I-T-T-I-E. <laughs> what the freak? I had to buy that for like um, originality alone. But anyways guys, I just wanted to show you that. Oh my word. Those cost $20 at Meyer, by the way. But those are actual licensed Hello Kitty and that one is not. And um, this one is just another smart clean sweep. Lots of random generic stuff. What the freak is that? When I walked by, I, I saw that and I was like, what the freak? It's a bloody skull with like a worm or a snake coming out of its eye socket. That's gruesome, guys. Everything in here is pretty redonkulous, if you ask me. Except for this harlequin bear. He's kind of cool. Oh my word, you guys. I can't believe there's a Hello Kitty watch in there. What the heck is that about? And then um, here's like that shooting star machine that's always rigged and you can never win at him. I did a video on this that is labeled, if you want to look for it, it's labeled very, very weak claw machine at my mall. I think that's what it's labeled. I want this. I want that blue thing. Oh my god. I have to play my cell phone bell today and I have to buy groceries and I have to put gas in my car. Now I already bought a little bit of groceries. I already put $20 gas. The money that I have in my pocket right now is supposed to be to pay my cell phone bill. I hate this machine so much like it it's one of those machines that is perfectly like rigged to um, grab really 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 hard and then loosen its grip on the way up I, I read about those machines where they are specifically programmed to do that to grab really hard and like give you a chance like make you hope that you think you're actually gonna win and then it like lets go so yeah there's I spent like way, I've spent way too much money in this machine before. I think I spent like over $30 before trying to get one of these tigers. But it was a tiger and not this kind. This one's kind of zebra print and mine doesn't look like that. I want the blue leopard one. He's so cool. I like blue. Blue's like my favorite color. But there's no way that it's going to get that and drag it all the way over there. So, um, and I never did a video of like this. This is a brand new one. It's called Bloom Buster and nobody has ever, ever won it because I've never seen anyone play it. It's just basically like one of those rigged car carnival games. I guess you're supposed to bust that balloon and then and then the prize is an iPad mini. I didn't even know there were, there were mini iPads. It's kind of weird. And it cost a dollar, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it cost a dollar. So it's just a quick overview of like some of the new stuff that's like over here. They keep on moving it all the time. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I am going to go get some lunch. It's like around 1 p.m. right now. And then I'm going to get some change and then um i'm gonna try for like the knockoff hello kitty i mean like why not i can't like get too obsessed i get too obsessed when it's hello kitty and that's just that's not fair that's my kryptonite okay there is a there is a licensed um disney thing in here it looks like a mickey mickey necklace and there's like a little diva thing in the back my zoom doesn't work guys i don't know why there's just I, don't know. I usually don't play this machine, but if I do, I'll let you guys know. So, knock off. Thumbs up for knock off Hello Kitty watch. 
I know, wouldn't that be thumbs down since it's like a fake? But thumbs up because that's kind of cool in its own right. So anyways, thanks for watching guys and uh, that was my finger. Okay, bye.